Welcome back to another unboxing and today we're bringing you a special uh, request from Dylan Rogers who was kind enough to donate $60 to us on Patreon to open any booster box of his choosing and this was the one that Mr. Dylan Rogers had decided that he wanted to see us unbox so thank you for that. <laughs> Remember this is your fault. If you guys don't know at this point already this was from the joke about Code Is that Ash the onslaught of Dragon Souls expansion? <laughs> Did you pull that from the new expansion set? Did you get it from the new expansion set? Yeah, that line. Uh, about Kodok's video about why he hated Vanguard. It's pushing a product which is kind of scummy. I can't believe he's already using cards from the onslaught of Dragon Souls expansion. So, let's just uh Oh, man, I cannot. Stop. Give me, give me. <laughs> I do this for a living. At least someone's living. Are we preserving the box? Uh, I think it's a relic. I think we should. Oh, that's a lot of packs. Shuffle wow. them. <laughs> no, the, the bottom to the, the left was supposed to be the oh, SD. <laughs> All right. So do we open a pack one at a time, or do we, like, do uh, each of us? Kind of just open. Okay. Wait, I think I already got a triple rare. Double rare, never mind. <gasps> Yo, this is back when doubles! Oh my god, this was the Bermuda card. Oh my god. Remember when this wasn't even a card? Uh, oh, it's upside down. Remember when this wasn't even a, a, a card? A clan? No. You couldn't build a clan yet. Could you not? I thought that was Neo Nectar. Dude, I found no. you! <laughs> <laughs> Ghosty Rick. Oh, is that Kimnara? Yeah. Whoa, look at that rare foiling. Wow. Also, this is back when we had glitter rare for uh, uh, doubles. Monkey. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> 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 Alright guys, thanks for watching. <laughs> We're having some technical What's the difficulties. Oh, Lucky the guy, Bird. The guy's like, I did not pay 50 for this! Oh my god, oh, remember? wow. Y'all remember that, 10k vanillas? This, yeah, the, I actually really like the double recoiling on these. Yeah, that's pretty. Mr. God Mr. damn, Nightmare. Captain Nightmare's art is gorgeous. Um, this was back when, uh, you know, the only Great Nature card was the 8k vanilla. Dudley Dan. What's it? I'm, I'm Dudley, Dudley Dan. Dan. Who you call? Three minutes. Nice. That's all it'll take to defeat you. Oh, the classic. That's when it first came out. Because these sets are a mess of clans. Uh, dead Yo, I got Rumble. Mecha Trainer! Oh, sick. Ugh. Oh, Richard, I found you again. Wait, I thought it was only one trigger per pack. Oh, General Seafried. Is it? Hey, oh, wow, cool. The That's, football guy. This was a double R? Yeah. Huh. What's the triple R then? Skydiver? Yes. I don't know. It's the dude who's going, like, he's like, Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. With any luck, we'll see him soon. Ah, Dancing Cutlass. Ooh. Ah, Chappy the Ghosty. Yo, throwback to Grandpa. That was an actually... A decent card. It was a decent card. It was. I think this card was actually like. When it's placing Guardian Circle Search, you up to one grand blue, put it into your drop and shuffle. Yeah, yeah I think that was that's actually really used. good. <laughs> Throw back to this being used in the uh, <laughs> the Sonic uh, seven, Blue deck. Yeah, I just said that. Yeah, the Grand Blue Turbo. God, that deck's a classic. No, I'm pretty sure they still have that channel. Panther. Aha! Nice. Soul Saver Dragon. Oh, cool. Young Pegasus Knight. They oh, go together. Wow. They're remember my Ichi, friends. Remember when Aichi was like, this has tits. Remember when Aichi was like, um, you're right, that means it could still be a guy. Guys can have tits. Uh, remember when Aichi was like, um, you know, I'm going to win with this card? And yeah. Won? Yeah. yeah. Also, this was um, back when uh, Blazer Idols had uh, thighs. They showed their thighs. And then in the Bermuda oh. set, they're wearing it all the way up. Mm. Like, they're, 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 the, th the thighs are censored. Of course, it. horny little eighth grade year, uh, eighth okay, grade. Hey, you lied, that. Miles. What? That's the other great nature card. The sexual harassment oh, panda. Oh, my bad. Why? Why? What? What? What did the panda do? He he teaches you to not sexually harass people. <gasps> Where's Why? that from? Don't call him the sexually harassing panda. I said then. sexual harassment. Yeah, don't don't call him that. That's his name. That's like saying like, oh, I have sexual harassment class in a, in a bit. <laughs> you, don't yeah, you don't say that. Don't say that. Maybe you don't. <laughs> Unite attacker. I've never God. seen this card in my life. Look at her abs. That's not Adelaide. Huh? You're That's right. not Adelaide. We need Adelaide again. Uh, but we are back to when uh, Forerunners were Do you foiled. think she's still alive in Overdress? Adelaide? I, hope so. I would like to think so. Yeah. She looks like she could oh, live about Spirit another 10,000 years. Is that no. all the triplers? 
I think it was two uh, per box back then, or was it three? Yeah, well, that's the second one, so we'll have to wait well, and we find out. We have a couple out. more packs, yeah. God, Spirit Exceed was a rear guard card. That's funny. Huh. It was also Superior huh. Ride, my guy. You used it for Superior Ride, right? Uh, here's another Bermuda card. Miles, I just continue to prove you wrong. What do you mean? There's another Bermuda card. You're like, these were the only Bermuda. You couldn't make a No, card. sorry, I've literally to say never like, seen this card in my I meant entire life. I to say, life. like, this set. What do you mean? This was in the anime. Yeah. It's Skype Tarot. <laughs> Skype Terror. Oh, yeah, you're right. They probably said Skype Terra in the I heard the them show. say Skype, Skype Terra, yeah. Yeah. It's kind of like when they uh, they kept saying. <laughs> what Battle, happened? To... They kept, say, kept saying Battlefield Tempest Sagamore when uh -huh. it's actually Battlefield Storm. When are we going to get um, Discord Terra? Also, remember OG Akane. Ah, uh, OG Akane. Mr. Fraud? Master Fraud. Master Fraud. The, oh. fraudy, the Fraudian Slip. I really like the... Hey. Oh, the good draw. Yeah. That you know card. What? Remember that was like this, 20 bucks? This printing yeah. is the one with the most dark, like, thing. The rest of them kind of look faded. Like, they're, like, more faded coloring. So this one uh -huh. actually has the most saturation, like, yeah. from the set. I wish they went back to doing that. <laughs> when I built... When I, when I built Cargo, I specifically looked for Gatling Claws from this set because I wanted the other... The newer ones just looked ugly. Because they looked... Oh, uh-huh. Are Is we, that the last one? You guys have the last two, right? Alright. Okay. Bless the pack, Miles. <gasps> I pulled the last triple R, I think. Oh. There it is. Cover R. Oh, cover R. Holy shit! You gotta put it in the middle. Richard, put it in oh. the fucking... Stop it! Oh! Kira. Yo! Oh, wow. Remember her? Kira Ra. Yeah. In another three minutes. Yes. Oh, get all this out of there. <laughs> God pack. Alright, so if we were back in 2012... How would we rate this box overall? Like, I'd give it a solid. Because if you didn't want to build, like, because I before, think that uh, I, Soul Saver was the card that was like this was definitely the money card because I don't think Barkle was banned yet. No, it wasn't. So what about the double R's from uh, that? The uh, double R's there. Okay. The double R's were for the most part okay. I mean, Pegasus Knight. I don't know if this really needs to be a double R, but I guess it was good with the amount of like. I remember when I was a kid, I used to think double rares were like super expensive. Charting? Yeah. No triple Some of them were. You know, wait, I just realized there wasn't a single PG in this whole set. No, we didn't pull any. Yeah. Dang, so this was like not really a money set to invest in then because you didn't get any PGs. No, you no, got no. Uh, the Ground Blue PG, we just didn't pull it. Because oh. this is the set that Ground Blue came so out this, this box just sucked then. <laughs> well, for, in terms of Grand Blue. Yeah. No, but we got the cover card, and yeah. the, we got these two. We got those two. I thought this came out in set we one. We definitely pulled an Akane wrong. and a Pongol, so we have guaranteed. Basically, if you're on a budget, Alfred was set one. Yeah. Yeah, okay. You would have guaranteed got the Soul Saver off if you pulled Akane, so that would be good. I like Spirit Exceed. Did, either of you, did any of you guys pull an Iron Tail Dragon, like the grade one? It was a common, I think. Oh, let's see. Because ah. I know I pulled the grade two of this, <laughs> so if you got... If we got an Iron Tail oh, yeah. somewhere Didn't in this box, this, this was, it this has Superior something. Ride. Yes, that's right. The Grade 2 is the one that let you Superior Ride. Uh, this was basically the Kagura deck you would have built, because Overlord wasn't like the most viable option. Yeah. Because right? we didn't do, have the end yet. You would do this, Vortex Dragon, and Overlord as like... As a rear guard. To clear yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, basically. Well, this worked on rear, too. It's van or rear. It gets yes. 3k for each retired thing, which is pretty good. Yeah, well, because you part. combo that with Overlord, because Overlord will attack the rear guards. And it's so only you're during... Saying... Is it? It's... Oh, yeah, it's rear no. guard is put into the drop during your main phase. Fuck. It's an auto that says during your main phase. That's funny. <laughs> oh, yeah, here it is. <laughs> oh, yeah, this cool. card. So, yeah, oh, we... my God, it was Counterblast 1 get 1k. I remember yeah. those. Yeah, those are funny. So we have the right, the superior right for this, so... And we also have the search target for Soul Saver. So if you're on a budget... Oh, here's what you did, Richard. You did Soul Blast 5, because it's set up if you pulled off the Superior Ride. Yes. Because it was the grade 1 and the draw trigger, right? Yes. Yeah. So you pulled off the Superior Ride, that gives you 5 soul. And then you use it, you retire a full field, at least that's what you know you thought, and then you swung for 25k. You know, we only retired one card, though. That, that really Wait, sucked. Wait, Soul Blast 5? To, to retire one card. Choose one of your opponents. What the? Oh, I thought it was their whole field. No, it's just one card. Soul Saver is the broken one because it gave... <laughs> It gave, it gave three things 5k. Yeah. So this was way better. And this is just Soul Blast 5 Retire oh. 1. Did you get the grade 2 in there? Yeah, there we go. That's this was the Oh, whole, the grade 2 is what allowed you this to. This was the whole uh, ride chain. Yeah. yeah. Why was this superior ride the set? Honestly, uh, it gave you... Oh, yeah. And the yeah. Spirit Experience Exceed, Exceed was the Soul Saver. get all the pieces out. And uh, Blazing Flare. I almost built a Blazing Flare deck for my cousin when uh, I was a kid. But I decided not to because he was a little shitbag. 
Spirit exceed. Uh, was that it? No, Samurai Spirit. Yeah, if you have Samurai Spirit, uh, one, if you have Samurai Spirit and Knight Spirit, and rear guard, you rear. Soul, yeah, and then you ride that from drop. And you have a grade two, yeah. If you have a grade two, grade two Vanguard, so you could ride it with any grade two Vanguard. Okay, so you'd probably go into like Ruin Shade. What was we didn't the... even pull Rune Shade. Oh, that's right, because Rune Shade had a Mega Blast, right? No, Rune Shade was the one that's uh, on attack, you mill two, and it gets 2k. Doesn't he also have a Mega Blast? Though? She. Rune Shade's a girl? No, you're thinking of uh, Bat. Bat oh, bat, Rune Shade, bat my bad. Yeah. yeah. Bat, whatever the. the Baskirk. Baskirk, yeah. Yeah, because that's what you did. You fueled Baskirk. Coffee break. Yeah, you, you rode this, and then you rode Baskirk hmm. the following turn. If you yep. didn't want to use Baskirk. Yeah, yeah. Just dancing cutlass, get your hands. Uh, well, <laughs> you you can use dancing cutlass to get spirit exceed into trap. I just love how like and then use spirit exceed they really, skill to re. Oh no, no no wait. They really wanted you to like. Uh, oh yeah. Play down the triggers you drew. This one was the obviously banger because yeah. not only was your draw trigger had a skill to so kill starters, it's just a draw. So like discarding it for a superior ride makes sense. You have to lose a whole, whole trigger, trigger. Yeah, a whole time for this. Shield. You know, like. That sucked. Yeah. And I love how, like, I think Kagura, <laughs> I think somewhere in here there's a Margul. Like, that we got Margul and this, and then Grand Blue just got Vanillas. Yes. It was just really, I think it's really funny. They could have made this a skill-based card. Like, Banshee, like, we didn't get, oh, yeah. we did. So, look, they didn't even use the crit that has the skill. <laughs> like, they could have just used... Night Spirit's art and put the skill like they could have just swapped these. I did love these draws though, cause like in a in like a last turn, you know, like a last uh, mm -hmm. last gasp kind of thing, you would call it and then like draw into something that you might need. Yeah, this this card was made its way all the way back into G. In, yeah, yeah. All, every trigger was you in G. You ran a trigger if it had a skill, pretty much. Remember how important these were. <sighs> What were they? The special intercepts? The, the, not special. The S special intercepts. No, S special. S special applies to archetypes. Mm. Arch archetypes. Let's see, I found the ground blue special one. Special intercept was just intercept gain 5k. These came these came back, but they're worse in uh, overdress. We have the, the intercept. The, 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 the ruin shade for the uh, booster. The mm -hmm. um the like the like caveat is that they're 10k base. Ah. You know, 10k base power. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it's it's still 5k shield. It's when you intercept, soul blast one, counter blast. No, soul blast one, give 5k shield. Mm. Okay. I, mean, I like how we had grade zeros system. without forerunner. Yeah. Yeah, Bushy definitely gave us some like, oh my god, this is 3k. I think Bushy just wanted to give us like a little bit more, I don't know, player expression, right? There's just a lot more do. like ways to build this up with, like a scary. budget Look. deck. Look, it says if you have a Bermuda Triangle Vanguard, and we didn't even get like enough. We didn't Bermuda have any triangle, grade threes. Like you can't even use this. Yeah. Well, yeah. We. No, that's that's what I'm saying. You had like, you had like, the skeleton for a deck, but it didn't do anything. This is literally the exact same skill as Luckbird. Uh huh. But just worse. Uh huh. Because it's a grade zero. Yeah. Yeah. At three k. Is it a counterblast? No, no it's, so a it's, it's, it's a It's a Luckbird. They swapped the color. No, they oh. changed the colors for the cost. Oh, well, I mean, you could also say it's a Dancing Cutlass clone. Like, yeah. They literally just went, hey. But also, Dancing Cutlass was better Bermuda. inherently because you wanted to fill your drop zone. Yep. Yeah. That is very true. Should I be the goat? Oh. Hey, that's in a oh, card. Oh, shoot, it's locked. Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> How'd you do that? <laughs> uh, no comment. Needs a couple more years, Jose. Remember when we all thought uh, Link Checker wasn't going to come back after season three? Mm. We were like, it's too, bro it's too busted, bro. Yeah. I remember people also complained about Dominate being a broken... Thing. And it wasn't. It really wasn't. It really My wasn't. bad, guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, when I first heard it, I was like, oh, no. But then I played against it one or two times, and I was like, oh, I'll no. just call the trigger that skill is to shove into the soul and draw. You know, I'm like, cool, yeah. sure. Well, you know what? I it was like when everyone was like, oh, Mega Colony is, you know, the, the first uh, Mega Colony G deck is super broken because you get to draw off of your opponent's cards. So I'm like... Your opponent won't call anything. At no, her. no, they forced called. It forced oh. called them in, paral in paralysis, but I was like... I'll just retire my own units. Yeah. Like, and draw off of them, because I used Abyss. Right. I mean, I used uh, Claret. I was right. like, okay. Yeah, it was whatever. Okay. I pissed my friend, or our guys, I pissed my friend off a lot with I'll that. give Grand Blue this, though. The fact that, just looking, this is a three-card combo, this yeah. is a four-card combo. Like, you, yeah. needed, you needed to get these three out, right. and this had to be on Van. Although I will... They gave and, us a second And, one. like... The, this just needed to be randomly milled into yeah. your drop zone, and then Which these will, were just... Which uh, will definitely happen, because yeah. it's Grand Blue. And these are just basically, like, this is just a, a grade one filler. 
Trigger, you're gonna run anyways. So it's a crit. You have to run. Well, it. so hold on, Richard. This was probably gotten off more yeah. than this ever was. You can call this out from the drop too. You just have to make sure you draw into the crit. Yeah. Yeah. Because you need these two in drop. We yeah. just need to you need get this these in out. drop. You need to get this on board. Yeah. But Soul Saver was the easiest. And then also, wait, where the where is Mister Ghosty? Ghosty. Chappy. Chappy. Uh, right there. Yeah. Boom. You just pull this in. <sighs> Boom. Right. Get the combo. Wow. So, that's really good card design for the time. Yeah, it was just kind of really yeah. underwhelming. Why didn't we have? Why don't we have that? And like, like V didn't have a lot of that right off the bat, right? It it didn't have like the setup things. I think it did, but it was just because Overdress is coming back with it with the ride deck. They're like, you're, there's incentive to like utilize that. Mm -hmm. I like the limit break version because it didn't force you to like get rid of a crit. Mm. It had a grade two, a grade one, and then uh... yeah, the other. The, I remember it. The, the oh, the, the horse. But one, those right? were those were rear guard only. Yeah. Their scales were like if it's in drop, you soul blast two to call and call then it on top of something. Yeah. It's soul. It's soul blast to pick either a card or specifically that card. I think it was just a card. Retire it and then call this card in yeah. its place. Yeah, and you did that for a grade one, two, and three. Mm -hmm. So like it was cool. The soul blast filled your uh, drop zone. Yeah. Um, I guess it kind of made sense, but I guess it would just be tough if you had to pick between going full bass mm. kirk or just yeah. using cutlass just right. for resources. Right. Because at the end of the day. There, this was its skill. It was a vanilla the rest of the game. Where yeah, least, you just did it to get this one also Saber in this. You didn't have to do the right chain. You still had a good card. Didn't this yeah. set also introduce that double lar that was uh, 8k, uh, grade 3, that you counter blast to call anything from the drop zone? That is the set. You're right. Oh, yeah. uh, I forgot about that. What was the main. Baskirk was just the main grade 3 for you in Grand Blue, right? There was another one that was like a death. death sight thing, kind of like, where it was like. Oh, Thanatos? No, that was in Limit Break. Okay. There was something, I think it retired, I, I don't uh, remember, but yeah, I just remember yeah. there was Bass Kirk and Spirit Exceed was just basically like how you had to play Grand Blue. Yeah, Grand Blue was set. definitely a rear guard clan. <laughs> Didn't have the best vanguard. I think that like at the end of the day, this, was it this Bas clan basically told you no matter how cool you pulled off your combo, it comes down to the triggers at the end of the day. <laughs> I remember, Congrats, kid! Yeah. Superior road. I remember like, back then they uh, Alan had this janky ass combo where he would just call the uh, eight crit eight k ah eight k grade three counter blast two to call a blaster blade from his drop zone because you could clan mix back then. Yeah, yeah. and it was like counter blast four just to kill off one thing. It's funny because I wasn't even playing when this thing came out. Me neither. Yeah, that's also a fun thing to think about. I was just watching the anime. Yeah. I was being depressed playing Assassin's Creed on a Sunday. Which one? Assassin's Creed 3? Yeah, uh, that's my first one. Yeah, Connor Kenway fights for so much justice. I also think that it's funny mm. that this deck does not work at all if you don't have Ruin Shade. Yeah. Or the grade one uh -huh. when it boosts. Like, there's no other filtering yeah. in the deck at yeah. all. Greed Shade, where did I, I threw it somewhere yeah. over there. Oh, well. Thank you guys for watching. Um, if you guys ever feel like you want to donate to our Patreon and give us another box for us to open of your own choosing, we do have that option. Thanks to you guys again, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye. Is that the onslaught of Dragon Souls expansion? At that moment, the kid like struck a pose and said, did you pull that from the new expansion set? Did you get it from the new expansion set? Yeah, that line. I laughed and I said, did you really just quote the lamest line in the entire show? Because it was a silly line. I thought he was making a joke and I figured he'd laugh too, but he didn't. Instead, he looked at me as though I had just kicked his dog in front of him. I can't help but pause when the reason I made him feel let down was because he was convinced that a grossly, disgustingly, obviously commercial phrase was some kind of epic one-liner.